She's probably not popped these planks before, and they're quite sort of. They uh, tend to look at them the first time, so Sven can trot down to these plank, uh, trot over the planks. See, we've got these poles on the angle, so because just how what I try and do is just help him the first time that they jump around a course with a filler to make myself into a wing. You know, if there's two of you, one either side, that will get two or three popping around together, so they can actually keep themselves. Oh, he's got a distraction that Sven keeps his shoulder. By the fact that she did that in quite a nice relaxed way, then it's no problem to just raise it to a cross and uh, let her pop over these. So what I want Sven to think about is that he goes in a straight line and when he lands, he went a little bit left, she needs to jump in the middle and go straight. That was a lot better because she stayed straight that time. Now I'm just going to introduce trot pole because as we get bigger shorter as we get bigger just trot spin it uh, it helps the mare to that she's gonna get on the right stride so you get a little look at the poles but she actually landed and went straight then Then just try and keep the same rhythm in trot. One, two, same rhythm. Good. You know, and then she dropped her head. Did a really nice job of it then. Once then just to think about keeping in front of the leg in a nice rhythm and not over worry about the distance. As you can see there, you know, the shoulder hung right out there so it wasn't straight at all back there. But obviously having people here is something we don't can't emulate, it's something we find more difficult to show. Basically, she was only just back, you know, sat on and ridden away. So 